Welcome to your first space flight, little Nova. I'm glad the Space Vets crew is now complete. Thanks, Jenny. Space is so exciting. Mm -hmm. Nobody heard you. You can come out later. I promise. Oh. All good back there? Yep. All good. Please, Lennox. Be quiet. Or Mom will take you back home. No more noise. Understood? Wait, little Nova, did you bring Lennox? Huh? Oh no! Stop him, Loops! The instruments. Watch out! Oh. You can't be serious! Stop him! He deactivated the autopilot. Loops? The ship's out of control. By the leaf of the holy laurel tree. Stop him. Almost have you. Oh. Ah, careful. Gotcha. Oof, that was really close. I'm responsible for safety on board, and I have to say, this little guy better start behaving. From now on, Lennox will behave. I promise. Eh, it's too late now to turn around and take Lennox back home. But if he'll be traveling with us, he'll need a teeny tiny helmet. Loops, can you handle that? No problem, Captain Nova. Here you go, a helmet for Lennox. Let's see if it fits. Like a pea in a pod. I hope he doesn't sprout. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now it looks like our crew is actually complete. An emergency. Mm -hmm. You've reached the space beds. We rescue pets and more. This is an emergency! Our planet Borcaroni is turning into a desert! It's way too hot for us in the city. Oh. We'll be there as fast as we can. You know what that means. Everyone get ready for hyperspeed! The space vets are here! Hi everyone, we're here to help! I'll go check out the dirt. Why is the desert getting bigger and bigger, Mom? I'm thinking it has something to do with the food they eat on this planet. Aha! Uh -huh. Jenny, what's the situation? My analysis shows all of the trees around the city were cut down for cornfields. Now the sand from the desert can spread uncontrollably. Oh dear, the sun's hotter than a thousand chilies. Should have brought my watering can. Good, that should do it. And now, back inside, quick. Analysis complete. Thanks, Denny. The ground is way too dry. It can't hold water because there are no trees here. Wind can now just blow away all the dirt. The only thing that can help is planting new trees. Only then can the ground hold water again, and the desert won't spread. Mom, Lennox is gone! Oh, oh no, no. Oh, no! Don't worry, we'll find the little guy. Loops, satellite cam activated. There he is. He's with the desert foxes. It's way too hot for him. How can these animals live in the desert, Dr. Leaf? Animals that live in the desert have different tricks to survive the heat. Some of them store water in their bodies. Others bury themselves in the sand during the day and come out only in the cool nights. And these ones have especially large ears through which they release heat back into the air. But Lennox only has tiny cat ears. And that's why we're gonna have to rescue him from his unfortunate situation. Fletcher and little Nova, you get Lennox. Dr. Leaf, Loops, and I will handle the desert problem. 
We'll get super fast growing trees and plant them everywhere around the city. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Space, space bets, bets. let's go! Let's go. Jenny has new weather info for us. Watch out! A desert storm is coming. Oh no! We have to help Lennox, Fletcher. Jenny, how far? We're almost there. <coughs> the fox has left Lennox all by himself. We've got some headwind. Don't worry, Lennox. We'll get you out of there. Together, you can do it. How can I help you, Fletcher? I've got an idea. Carefully activate the tractor beam, little Nova. Yes. Almost got him. Well done, little Nova. Like a real pro. And now, let's get out of here. Lennox secured. Space Vets! Oh, Lennox. I'm so glad to have you back. Foreign planets are not the place for solo adventures, Lennox. Here's one tree, and another tree. Press the soil gently so the roots can grow well. Oh, am I doing it right? Plantastic! In the first few days, the plants need lots of water. I'd say, mission accomplished. Soon, your city will cool down. Thank you, you've saved us all! Bye! Catch you on the green side! Come visit us again! Jenny, give us your prediction, please. Coming right up. A giant success. Yippee! Oh, that looks wonderful. If the residents take good care of their plants, the forest will grow back soon. Now, you're a real space vet, little Nova. You did a great job here, Sprout. High five! Whoopsie, careful. <laughs> Ready for a new Space Vets mission crew? Ready, Ready, Ready for, for a new, new journey, journey to, to the, the stars. stars. Oh.